this must be with the uh, reset. Okay, I guess we're all ready to go. I just wonder where you were. I realized you were probably over here. <laughs> okay. Hey, you want to go schmuck? Okay. Uh, children's class over in that corner. Uh, everybody else just line up here because we're filming. Okay. All right. Yeah. Yep. Basic present. A lot of times we get caught up in words. What am I supposed to do? And everything. You're there. Okay. You've got your breathing. Not too. How many of you in Aikido class you don't want to be too much like a. Uh, no. Easy, alert, ready. Not in an aggressive state, nor in a passive state. I'm kind of just there. Okay. okay. Um, two hands. Yeah, I'm just reverse behind me. So yeah. <laughs> Actually, why don't we? I just realized filming sometimes, you know, it's a thing which is fun. Some, you know, somebody's tapping your hand. I react. Just there. There's some weights and brown. And right about here, you know, I kind of get in my shoulders and I, I tie it up. Easy. Through the camera. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> yeah. I'm frozen here. I just shift my weight a little bit. Palm is up. Thumb up from the under. All right, there he's still holding, saying, yep. Yeah. So I'm going to relax. Turn my hip and just flip here. Somebody may trap you, crap your hand, they're going to do something else. So you're ready. Eventually it gets to there. But we're going to break it down frame by frame. Seating the other hand, thumb is up. Now, right here, I try to pull free, and he says, You can't. So easy, relax, flip free. And notice this is a circle. I'm going to catch here. Okay, so let's. Uh, we're going to start out with two hands on one. Okay. okay. I'm right about there. Okay. 
Um, yeah, yeah, I mean, you stand the other way, stand the other way. Yeah, well, you're, <laughs> you're jamming me, aren't you? Yeah, do what I mean. If you stand the other way, I don't do anything. I just go like that. <laughs> All right, so mostly, you know, we're standing, you know, like in a mirror position. Okay, now you got weight there. Okay. Hesitant. Hesitant. <laughs> Yeah. Okay. Mirror. Hesitant. Feel your own way. This is underneath. But what I'm going to do is turn my hip. Feed it. Now, right here. Which is going to say I'm still tied up here. Oh. Good. <laughs> you see what I mean? It's a little move. Okay. So we're starting out. Mirror. Right. <laughs> I'm still tied up here. So I'm going to turn my hip a little bit more. See. Thumb is up. Now he can keep holding. It's a little pain in the butt. You know, it's like situation, bad situation won't go away. Easy. See the circle? Don't react. Okay. All right. Well. And now we do a little bit right here, okay? Uh, it's an interesting thing with a hand knee, okay? Now, now stand with your, yeah, all right. Good. <laughs> now stand with the other foot forward. He's jamming my foot. Okay, so, you know, somebody is uh, giving you a hard time. Well, let's, let's, right. Let's, 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 let's do I mean. Yeah, so, so one of the things to do is somebody going to come for your body or something like that. Boom, 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 boom. boom. What are they doing there? Right. Now here, in a position where he's also staying. Now, reverse the feet. One, he's going to boom, collapse. Two, boom, he's not safe. So the harmony also, you know, is an area where when somebody's moving, you know, there are a lot of things you can do. Right? A lot of things you could do, I said. So, you know, right, we're, we're saying, you know, mirror. He grabs from no, I'm trying. Yeah, I'm being jammed here. All right. Mm -hmm. Now we do this one handed a lot. Okay. Boom. Now we're doing the two hands. Why? I'm used to one hand, but then I'm not used to two hands. So I swing to my shoulder. Easy. Boom. Now my other hand is a thumb is up. I'm going to feed it. All right. Now I'm kind of my shoulders. It says, I'm going to bump me with your shoulders. Ah! Bump me with your shoulders. Good. You got your balance. You got your center. You're relaxed. You're easy. You're alert. Okay? Not a lot of thinking. Although you understand what you're supposed to do. Okay? So run things right here. You know? I stand back and forward. I'm, I'm like this. Well, guess what's open? <laughs> okay. <laughs> you, you don't have to be taught. I, I just learned that I said, no, just do that. You know? Okay. Now, right here, I'm tying you up. Okay, sort of, metaphorically speaking. Right? Easy, drop your weight. Good. Turn your hip. See how that feeds that in, right? Now, right there, you try to break free, and I'm strong, right? Mm -hmm. yeah. So just twist your wrist. Oh. Oh. Now, this is not fun because you're in your, you you whack me in the face. So you're going to slide your hand down. Okay. Yeah, and you're going to grab the back of my collar, and you're oh. in a very good position, aren't you? Right? Yeah. You know, we can do you know, after all. It's quick. Ooh. <laughs> very quick. Quick. But you know, I'm going to try to do it quick, and I'll tie myself up. Oh. It's not really, it's quick. I'd say it's not fast. Come on. I'm in a good position here, aren't I? He's, he's aggressive, goes back. He's not really aggressive. He's just play acting for me. But he gets his own energy back. Okay? Right? The other side. Why don't we? Sorry about this, but back, why don't you do that? 
I look at myself. I say, God, I, I don't understand camera angles at all. You know, <laughs> Disney Marvel never hired me. You know what I mean? Uh, well, lately they've been having too many people like me. Actually, is what it is. Like, hey, now, but you're going to turn your head. Yeah. Okay, good. Okay. Now you're going to feed your other hand. Okay. Now thumb is okay. Okay. Um, thumb is up. It grip it this way. Uh, yeah. 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 Okay. Yeah. This way is okay. You know, in fact, we do that. Yeah. <laughs> we, do, we, we do that sometimes when we go that way. Yeah. Right. But, you know, it's, it's kind of like it. it's a point where I try. It's not the most. Thumb is up. I go like this. That's okay. But, but you're right here. It's such a tight situation that I'm. You know? Now, if I'm going to do that move, I might take a step back and then change direction. You see what I mean? Yeah, so, and you know, this situation, hopefully nobody gets caught up on somebody tying your hands up. Okay, turn. Now you thumb is up, you're gonna see that. Okay, good, now the break free, you just twist your wrist, yes. Now drop your elbow and slide a little bit more behind me and you're in a very good position, aren't you? Okay, All right, okay, got it, got it, okay. Yeah, so one of the things right here, just, uh, you know, somebody's trying to tie your hands up. Okay, no. Okay, no. One of the things right there. No, keep going. You too. Yeah. I'm keeping my arms in the right angle right here. Where's the little energy? Your energy is there. See what happens? You don't have to do anything. Now don't don't yeah. use the bicep. That motion. Bring your hip. Good. Feed your other hand. Okay, now feed your other hand. Now you're right there. I'm going to jam you. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Now right there. Just twist your wrist. No, not 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 yank your wrist. Twist it. Oh yeah. And slide your elbow down my back. And get the collar, and all of a sudden you got a pretty good position, don't you? Yeah. I mean, you know, I, ideally what you want right here is you want that motion, boom. But take a little practice. All right. All right. So one of the things, first of all, easy. No. Okay. Now, now right here. Put the other foot forward. Okay. We do another, you know, let, let's say he grabs and reverse your feet. Okay. Now reverse the feet again. Okay. Well, what, what I should probably do right here is this motion. Right. But reverse the feet again. See, we're mirror here, right? Not going to do that much good, is it? And then the simple wrist. Okay, right. so, and relax the tension in your body. Easy. If you're waving hi to somebody, you're gonna go like that. Huh? Easy. Now, yeah, good, now, let's do that with both hands. It's not too much. Okay, you're good, now, feed your other hand, now. Don't grab. Face your hip good. Now, let, let, come on. Very good. Now, it's still tight up. If they're trying to break free, turn your wrist. Okay. Now, slide your elbow down my back, and you're in a good position, aren't you? Right? I mean, sometimes they're coming this way. It looks, it looks so easy right here. It's like a boom. Right? But when you try to move at that speed, everything locks up. Okay. Yeah. Okay, right. A lot of times, a very fluid motion takes a lot of care, and in being able to that care teaches your mind to organize the information so you don't your thoughts don't tie up your feet. You see what I mean? You think only what you need to think. You're relaxed, you're fluid, to some degree you're in charge. The more words 
you're the, 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 you know, the more you know, I'm thinking about what I've done. Oh, okay, come on. Good, 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 good. Right. <laughs> that makes sense a bit? Yeah. Yeah. I don't, you know, the other thing right there, when you're trying to get away, Getting yeah, sort of an abrupt move causes you to tighten. Yeah, nothing. Okay. Every time you go, reverse the feet. Reverse the feet. Good. Mm. Reverse the feet. You're jamming me, aren't you? Hold on. Somebody holds me the other way. They're not much of a threat, right? <laughs> All right, now I'm going to try that move. Nothing. Nothing. Oh. Yeah, just fly for a little better position, right? I don't want to do a sudden move. And examine your harmony. Boom. So, yeah, boom. Okay? Now, a sudden move is not a panic move. If you're coming in this way, here we go, it's like boom, it's a sudden move. If you're coming in this direction, here, boom, okay, boom, boom, we're here. Boom, right? Boom. <laughs> you don't tie yourself up. You see what I mean? Right? Okay. Yeah. Okay. And we're not going to be lounge here for very long. Just settle. Your thoughts come like, I don't like shit this way. I don't need to be honest with you. I can be cool with it. I can be easy with it. Easy doesn't mean you're distracted. You can be very easy. You're totally present. In fact, in class, you come into class, you do crazy things to get you off your center so you find your center. Okay? Right? Yeah. This stuff is hard. <laughs> it's hard. It was easy to go dance around. It's like, that's pretty cool. It's fun in some way, right? But if I want to go dancing, then that's another thing. That's pretty cool, too. All right? Good. It's just easy, aren't you? And that's the template for a lot of things. Okay. Now, when I first went to Japan, I didn't speak any English. Actually, I didn't speak any Japanese. I was, all I had was English and Russian, you know, at that point. So, yeah, you know, what's going on here? And so, you know, um, Mary Heine Sensei spoke fluent Japanese. And we got to be good friends. And, you know, she was very much the boss. Okay. And so I used to be right, you know, it was kind of like, I wasn't robbing to her bat now. I would look at it like I was, she was a green hornet and I was Cato. If you remember the TV series, Bruce Lee didn't say very much, did he? And the only important thing, the green, the green hornet was one that did all the talking and everything. Cato was a mechanical genius and he was the arsenal. And he's a very balanced guy. And the only thing the green corner really had, he had a gas gun and some sort of electric shock weapon because he couldn't do anything. He just talked. Okay. But the most important words in the Green Hornet vocabulary was, get him, Cato. If you watch the show, it's really funny. And I watched it recently on YouTube because they're on YouTube, 30 minutes. And I realized I watched 30 minutes of a crappy show just to watch 30 seconds of Bruce Lee. But he was that good. Put up with a Green Hornet for, for 29 and a half minutes just to watch 30 minutes of Bruce Lee. Cato didn't say much. But 
but he was there. He was very easy. He didn't go out there and beat people up. He had to hear, get him, Cato. And it was usually bad people, right? Bad people. And Cato would get him. Now, what we can take from that, easy, focus, alert. Oh, no extra motion. And for us to begin to kind of do what Bruce Lee did, we're doing it in a different art form now. Every movement's carefully organized so it doesn't interfere with any of the other components of that motion. Each component has its own place. So your mind is clear, you're going to do a movement, there's a sequence to it. Any sequence is a component. And each component must be there in a way that enhances every other component. That's where your mind and your body connect and the result is flow. Because these movements were very flowing. We'd never seen anything like it, but they they were still flowing. They were sudden. Wow. <laughs> 30 seconds. Just to watch them move for 30 seconds, we put up with a green hoarder for 29 and a half minutes. But it was worth it. I go, Woo! Okay. So a different thing. We're in, in the art of IT, though, you're not trying to get anybody. Up. Okay. And so what we're kind of looking at here, okay, uh, and, uh, the camera and the goals are, okay, well, let's go this way, yeah. First of all, somebody's tying you up. The ideal thing is that you, you know what? He's going to make a move towards me. Okay, I'm already in another situation. Okay. Yeah. And, uh, and this is a like like a TV show where we're we're we're, we're filming it, <laughs> sort of, you know. And you get to be Cato. You get to be Cato. Bruce Lee didn't overreact. His movements were efficient. Now here, for example, is a change of direction. <laughs> Very effective. He bah, he's like that. We're not going to go punch people and kick people here. But on this particular one, you know, boom, 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 the components. One, your waist stays under. Everything comes up and goes out when you're at, that you're calmer. Instead so of trying to move your hand, move your wrist, turn your hip, feed your other hand. And right here, we panic and try to get away when we just are cool. This hand forms kind of a circle. You have a lot of time when you're in this position. Does that make sense? Well, I understand it, but when I'm grabbed, the other side, you know, I get, okay, so we practice. Free and easy, you're standing in your center. Your mind oftentimes, even here, will go nuts, but you gotta be like Cato. Very high, he says that she ran everything. I traveled with her and I did Cato. It's practice. Otherwise, I'm going, God, why am I there? I am a useless guy here. I don't speak the language. I'm Cato. She's the Green Hornet. <laughs> Without her, I mean, there's no car, there's no anything. So it's very important, right? But Cato, nobody noticed Cato. But they know the fact is, everybody. Love Bruce Lee. Nobody watched it for the Green Hornet, right? So there's an area right here. And he keeps holding. And I try to break free, make me stronger. Easy. 
this hand, so it's jamming this elf up. There's a lot of time here. In this position here, there's that much. Get him, Tato. <laughs> yeah, we're just play acting. You know, so it's a gets your partner. But we're working on ourselves. And we're just saying, okay, if we were a little bit more that way, we'd be calmer. We wouldn't let situations agitate us. We'd be looser, easier, but very focused. Okay? So we're not just doing a movement. We're, we're kind of polishing. We're creating ourselves to be a quote unquote, a, not Cato, the, the Green Hornet uh, sidekick. We're kind of like saying, there's an interior Cato for all of us. It's kind of fun. So go back, same partner. Okay, now come on. They're not going to tie you up. Why? Because they're out here. Settle, feel your tummy, feel your hips, feel your breathing. Don't try to move. Yes. Okay. You stand right there. I got a green mask on, and I'm yes, no, no, come on. And I'm negotiating with all the criminals and everything because I'm pretending to be a criminal. I can't do anything, but I bankroll the whole thing. You're you're Cato. I might have to get him, Cato. So you know who has who's in the room, what they're what they're packing, and you're cool. You're not supposed to go in there and beat the guys up. You may have to, depending on the situation. But generally, it's a get him, Cato. <laughs> All right, now you're ready. No, Cato doesn't do that. He's calm. He doesn't make a, an extraneous movement. No, you're thinking. And to your mind, your shape was foremost like water. That's what it's it briefly, it's briefly, okay? Right. They don't let Cato say anything until later. He's Formulated a philosophy, okay? Now use it. Now right there, where's that movement breaking down? Wait, wait, wait for Don. What are you? Come on, loose and easy. No, you don't go like that to him. Okay, fine. So go that to yourself. Good. All right, good. You're playing in the wrong room. You're playing the wrong role. Okay? You're supposed to be potato. Look at the wrist. Send somebody in now, you're tying yourself up. Don't think about moving me. You're free and easy. Now turn your hips. Good. Okay, now you put your weight there. This is the worst thing you can do. Right? When, when I set my weight here, you bump my weight. Oh, okay. I'll bump my weight. Good. Now, move. Good, 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 good. You're just digging a hole for yourself, aren't you? All right? Right now, you're you're categorically playing the wrong role. Okay, you're the guys the gangsters are getting. Okay, easy there. You're thinking, no, no, don't. See the whole room, soft eye. Okay, all that are thoughts going on. So your components. Don't go into phase one, two, three, four. No, see how that's easy. Easy. All you gotta do is that. You're good. But when you're thinking and struggling, you can't do that, can you? You're tying yourself up. I'm not tying you up. Good. Now. Good. Now you're thinking. Why are you thinking? Because you get tighter and tenser. No, oh, yeah. You are the thinking without thinking. Now, now that you got it, you put your muscle into it. Still, 
Open. Empty. That's where your movement is. Okay. Now there are four components here. Right now, there's too much activity and reaction. Right? You don't want an officer to go for the gun too quick. But you also don't want the officer not to go for gun, and a bunch of people die out there. So, you know, it's a tricky thing right there. See the whole situation. Don't move yet. You move, you're too quick. Easy. You haven't heard it yet. You haven't heard Devin Cato yet. If you're ready, you could. I go, get him, Cato. He goes, what? No, it doesn't work that way. Bruce, you know, Bruce Lee was a student. All right? Okay? Okay. 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 And, and one thing, you know, we were kind of playing around because one of my early influences was Bruce Lee. Big surprise. You know, it's what 1967 and 7:30 ABC, this this really bad TV show that has women. It's a bad show. I mean, I, I, you can watch it on YouTube. They have the whole series on there. You don't have to pay or anything. It's horrible. So again, you watch it for 30 seconds of Bruce Lee. That's it. But what can we learn from that? Huh. Sit right here. He gets to be Mary Heine. <laughs> he has the language. He has the, the senior foreigner. What was I going to do with my time? Presented I was Cato. See, a lot of times the support actor can be the star. That's what Uke is. Yeah, dream harder than nothing. I mean, yeah. I mean, he was a millionaire who could bankroll the whole thing and everything like that. But Cato was a mechanical genius to put it all together. And he was, he was so, <laughs> so you live for 30 seconds and get him Cato, right? In Aikido, you're not supposed to get anybody. What are you supposed to get in Aikido? You're supposed to get yourself. Calmer. Freer. Looser without being sloppy. Every movement has a series of components. There's a sequence to the component. And there is also the fact that you don't want one component to cancel out another one. Okay, now the movement has a series of A, B, C, D, but there is another one. That's you or me. We have a, bring a mind-body set, and we have a tendency to interfere. So if she grabs on, okay. I'm going to tense up and try. I'm going to go that way. I mean, I'm not blue they going bam like that. So that was fun to watch. Whoa, where'd that come out? Look at that kid attacking Captain. And then I see that. I try to copy it. Go. Okay. So what results really is the fact that I am connecting to her. Probably one of the best ways of uh, learning from Bruce Lee is to actually work with him directly, not just watch him in a film or something, but you can learn stuff. Yes, sir. I'm telling you, my good movement comes out of nowhere, but nowhere is very carefully constructed. Oh, I just want to be empty and shapeless for this like. It's too much in my head. Got it? Good. Okay. All right. So one of the things about the training in Aikido is, yeah, there are details in every movement. 
so you understand A, B, C, D. And then you realize what A, B, C, D is, you know, you're gonna get a clarity of A, B, C, D, but you're also, let's say there's another one, there's E, that's you. And sometimes you gotta sort of play out, right? I mean, you know, what was I gonna do? I didn't speak the language very well. And what was really funny is a lot of times, you know, I, I, that's where I would travel with Hikiduchi Sensei later. Of course, he was everybody, he was the Green Hornet, like to be Kato. It was a game. It was a total game. And one time, you know, what happens is uh, he, I was being Kato, right? And so somebody looks at me and says, I see your breasted bodyguard with you. And Hikiduchi Sensei was pissed. He was pissed, like, I don't need a bodyguard. I'm a 10th degree black belt and I get it. That's your bodyguard, because I was Cato. <laughs> All right, so I play those games a bit. You see what I mean? Right, another version of it. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, you ready. Oh, she's got to come in. Okay, good. We got into the move. Okay. Now, there's a bunch of different moves, but they come from the same place. Cato was there not to beat people up. Cato was there to protect the Green Hornet because Green Hornet was really a loser. Right? And he became the star. I wasn't watching for, for the, the actor that played the Green Hornet. I watched it because I wanted to see Lee, right? Okay. So the sense is what was good there. He wasn't trying to steal the, the attention of the show. He was a bodyguard. He was a sidekick. He was supposed to be robbing to Batman. But he stole the show. Okay? So in that way, what can we learn from the character? Loose. Easy, but not sloppy. All of his moves were carefully practiced and they all had components and they all reinforced themselves and boom, when he hit, he hit. When he kicked, he kicked. And it was, I've never seen anything like that. Whoosh! And he was Asian, me being Asian and growing up in the 60s, that was always like, boy, I, I don't fit in here. There's nobody to look up to right? <laughs> in this culture. And I, Bruce Lee, wow, he's Asian. You know, big thing for me, okay? Big thing for some of us. I mean, you don't realize how much we got influence by him. So, we got this. First of all, loose and easy, boom, doesn't mean loose and easy. No, I react. No. Now let go of this hand. We do this a lot. It's a reaction. This is not easy. But she's holding. Yeah, she is. <laughs> now, this feeds. And now I ruin the whole thing because there's another component and I try to break free and she's strong. She won't let me. Good. This stabilizes. So the simple turn of the wrist does that. The roll is really strong. Let's rotate my hip over here, get a better angle. I'm not here where I want to be. Okay? That makes sense? And we're learning a technique, but we're also creating ourselves to be more efficient. Home. More in the flow, so to speak. You see what I mean? If my mind is too caught up in a reactive mode, I can't move. I'm the Green Hornet and the green, I'm, I'm Kato and the Green Hornet, get him Kato, I go, what? No, it didn't happen. Kato had the whole scene scoped out so he knew who to take out, you know, to protect the Green Hornet, right? He was supposedly on the side of law in a secret way. So he was not just beating people up, he was a protector. Aikido has that, we're learning a protective art. But there are tools 
that we can't access until we start to work a little bit more on these, the character. Okay, let's go one more time. Okay, same part. Whatever, whatever. Okay, now we're gonna, we're gonna check again because it's easy. Okay, so first of all, I'm already held. You're not. You're not. You got a lot of options here. Right. Mm -hmm. right. Boom, boom, boom. Right. This prize never thinks you can do this. Now, how to unlock that? Stand easy, stand in a triangle. Yeah. Okay. What happens if you grab I'm not in a triangle. I have to do oh, it. Right. Manufacture a triangle very quickly. You get you get to do that. You don't have to do that right now. Okay, but you're standing in a triangle, which allows your hip to move freely. If you're standing square, you know, one thing square, he pushes me, I'm off balance. Okay, good. Yeah. After a while, when you're standing square, you 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 can accept that you're going to form a triangle. Then you run by doing this stupid scenario, okay? Wrist, hip, good, and feed, good. Now there's a little bit of what am I supposed to do? You know, wrist and hips, wrist and hips, wrist and hips, good, feed. You don't have to worry about that. Okay. Now, move a little bit more behind me, good. Yes. Okay, now, right there, so this stabilizes, just turn your wrist. What time is it? You're wearing one of those watches. What time is it? Yeah. See, if you go, I can't move. And to your mind, what time is it? Good. Now, slide the elbow down my back, take my collar. Okay. Okay, now we're in this position right here where we can also mess up. Okay. Oh, I have to go this way. Some so that I'm not feeling edges of the I'm looking Okay. I think it's not really hard, but what is hard is our mind looks at it and gets too noisy around everything. So after a while, you know, the point is, you know, who is that? Well, it's you, you, you don't really want to be the green one, you want to be Cato. Yeah. Right. I mean, really, I don't want to be the green horn. No, I don't want to be the green horn. Good. 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 Now, that's a tricky one. Stabilize. Okay. What time is it? <laughs> if you react right there, the whole thing implodes there. Okay. So, that's like a partner. Okay, good. All right, now step behind me a little bit more. Now, now this is the thing. How do we stand? It? Somebody standing right uh, there. Okay. Okay. Now, what we're gonna do? Turn your belly button that way. Oh, that way. Now turn it the other way. Now turn it back to the original direction. It's hips. Right. No, turn the hip. Turn the hip. Right. Step off of that. Okay. Yeah. Turn. Turn. Okay. Turn. 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 Now here, the change the direction. Okay. Okay. You can't let them time yet. I'm going to go the same. I'm going to change direction. 
Now here, what we're doing is a little different than that. Okay, we got that. Well, but I think I'm right here. I'm going to change direction. I'm going to change direction from being tied up and living trapped. Okay. <laughs> okay. So it's a shift not only of your proper body mechanics, but without the proper body mechanics, your mind goes crazy. So there's not a lot to think about. Okay. But life will do this to you. This is Donald Trump. A horrible thing to go through life when one guy go to prison. Horrible. But we do. Okay, now, right about here. Okay, good. Speed. Now, and now you're trying to break free. Don't. Oh. What time is it? Good. <laughs> now, slide behind. Now, Turn your belly button towards the clock. Now turn it back towards me and behind me. Good. And then you're you're you're, you're kind of well. If he's coming in this direction, well, here we go this way. Then we're creating You know, it gets to be very fluid, right? Over here. You can go a little lower if you want. I come up this way. I threw outside bouncing a basketball. I don't really want to think about. It. Oh, you're gonna go this way. Oh, you're gonna go that way. Okay. So you know it takes a little bit to get there because you know there's a component as you start to understand the basics and you, you start to like you go to a basketball camp and Stephen Curry's there. You you learn a couple of basics to work on them. You're gonna be more like what he's trying to do. And he's not gonna keep paying three bucks, a thousand bucks. I hope he doesn't keep paying a bunch of crap. He's gonna. It's the good basics for this and that. It may not exactly be what he's doing at that level. I gotta look and say, yeah, he does that. But, all right? Okay? All right. Yeah. Okay, you're, now I'm not tying you up. You're tying yourself up. That's the other thing. You're tying yourself up. Yeah. My okay. Time is yeah. Yeah. Okay. So right where you are, loose and easy. Loose and easy. You're not loose and easy yet. Yeah. All your key is right up here. <laughs> and then when you move, you get trapped out here. Loose and easy comes here and here. Then your hips move. Yeah. Okay. Now that was good movement. Except when I grab you and you go on your shoulders to move. Okay. So between the correct movement that you just did and your idea, there is a lot of misinformation. What's misinformation? Well, we're seeing it all over. I didn't lose the election. I'm gonna say that enough time that people believe it. You know, I don't need the whole country to do it. I just need my block to believe it. Right. I need a certain percentage of the Republican Party. And I hope for well, some crazy stuff, because we have a lot of crazy under the carpet stuff in, in, in vogue, because the uh, Republicans are sneaky. Maybe I'll steal the election. And if I don't steal it, I'll throw the whole thing in the courts again. It's horrible. And you could get so caught up in that you don't vote. You're going to go and you're going to vote. That's all. You're going to get too caught up in the noise. You're going to get too caught up in Donald Trump because he wants you to do that. He wants to control your mind so you do stupid things or don't act. Now you're going to go and file your vote. Now, right there, that's good work, except when you get in your shoulders, relax. You got to watch. What time is it? Turn it around. Okay. Good. Let's call reprogram. Your moves are largely correct, but it's the components are there, but there's so much attached to them that one cancels the next out. So yeah, the way Bruce Lee put it, it's a daily reduction. You reduce it. The amount of programming we get clearer. You get easier. I mean, Cato, if you look at Cato, he was a 
you know, five foot six inch oriental guy who wore a cap and a mask, and he was with this, this pompous guy. <laughs> Did you notice him? Not really, but you notice him when he kicked you across the room, <laughs> right? Get him, Tato. <laughs> so that was that was that was the only good thing that was. And then we got these three moves. Right? What else? Uh, Greenhorn had said he was a loser. So what I'm saying a little bit right here is, get him, Cato doesn't mean him. Seems to be very loose and easy, not sloppy. Good. Now, right there, you're attempting to break free. No, you're attempting smart. Look, what time is it? Look at your watch. Turn it, turn it. No, don't go that way. Don't I'm trying to get away. No. Right where it is. Yeah. yeah, there's some motion here, but that's like boom boom. Okay. Because we know the move. But right now, there's a lot of interference. If you're right there, you're sensing trying. You don't try to get away. You make a connection. That's, that's the other thing. You might avoid and getting away. Oh, you know, see, there's a consensus here. And then, you know, we go, nah, we tie ourselves. Oh. All right. You have to get those components right. But you have the right components. That's what's really tricky. Your one, two, three, four are perfectly fine, but what's messing up is what you bring to it. Okay? I'm not going to correct how you move. I'm trying to correct who moves. Okay, now right there. Easy. Easy. Oh, no, not easy. Energy. Bruce <laughs> Lee had a lot of energy. Oh. So I used to pretend, you know, I was a teacher, he said, you're a Mary Hyman. I'm Tito. Get <laughs> me saying. Okay. And I said that it was really funny. So, 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 so. You brought your, um, you know, your guard man with you, Dragoman. <laughs> and he was, you know, I'm a tenth degree black belt. What do you mean? You look, and then, and then, no, he's your, he's your protector. I go, I go, sorry, man. Yeah, I go, unless you're doing a pretty good group here. <laughs> right. right. Okay. All right. Go. Okay. Okay. And, and one of the, the things here, okay, um, like for example here, I'm going to try to get away. No, I'm going to try to make a connection. I'm going to try to do a technique. No, I'm going to, I'm going to try to connect her flow and my flow. Uh, so my, my psychology has to shift. See, Bruce Lee was so good that, you know, that what he found out when he went to Hong Kong, in Hong Kong, the show was Kato and the Green Hornet. He was top billing in Hong Kong. And since he was so, he couldn't get a break because nobody wanted to hire an Asian actor for anything other than menial roles. He went to Hong Kong. That was, he became an international. Really big star, and it all started basically. I mean, it, he was Bruce Lee, but it started with Cato, where he was the bodyguard. He was the, the Robin to the Batman. But that was the case where Batman went, huh? Nobody remembers the Green Hornet. A lot of people know who Bruce Lee is even now. Okay, so efficient motion. I'm going to try to move her. No, I'm just going to try to make a connection. You know, America is so polarized and we're 
then all this junk created by one guy in his life. Let's elevate our consciousness. And I know maybe, you know, and let's walk down a path together where we come together and the country is still a democracy. That's, that's what people need to hear. I want a beach going away. No, we want a consensus here. That's why a public trial is very important. Most of the witnesses are Republicans. It's all the Democrats. No. So you can be polarized where, where, where your mind is taken over by a bunch of junk. And here is my fear response is try to break free when I'm saying, okay, let's, 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 let's talk a little bit more. Now that I've got through there, I'm gonna get my way here now. Let's, let's double connect here. Does that make sense? And you know, Bruce Lee, you know, might throw a great kick, but you waited 26 minutes to see him do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, basically, so you, you learned a little taste, huh? Horrible plot. Crummy show. I want to see Bruce. <laughs> okay. So, kind of in that area, we're looking for an interior representation. What did he have? He was cool. When he moved, when things happened, but he didn't force him. His movement was efficient, practical. I mean, he watched it. He didn't do a lot of fancy stuff on the Green Hornet. It was just so sudden and so good, you go, what was that? Right? Mm -hmm. You know, since it was kind of the same way. You know, there, what is this, for example? There's the energy. Energy. Energy precedes the physical. You're going to grab. Her energy goes out. Good. Now, if I'm grabbed, I, I try to break free, but no, her energy is still going out. And so, you know, we, we start to reframe everything and, and part of, okay, I get this component, but a lot of what I'm doing is reprogramming me. So that the, the com components don't cancel each other out. I do a good job here, but then I try to do this. Okay, good. I get all the way to here and then I try to break free. No. After all the evidence is in, are you going to vote for Donald or not? You decide. I'm not going to try to tell you how to vote. But I want you to see everything. And we kind of want to be that way with ourselves a bit. People don't know this, but Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, when he was in New York before he moved to the West Coast to play basketball, what martial arts did he study? Aikido. He started with Yamada Sensei. He came out here, and for whatever reason, you know, he goes to the guy who publishes Black Belt magazine, and he says, I'm looking for a martial arts school. Do you recommend anybody? Right, and he didn't say he was looking for Aikido, you know, but I think he probably, I mean, he had a background there, all right. And um, the guy said, oh, this Chinese guy, you should check him out. So he goes to, <laughs> he goes to talk to Bruce Lee. And what happens is that, you know, I just have a discussion, but you know, the whole thing, why should I, trust you or study with you. So what happens is, you know, the whole thing with the kicking bag, Bruce Lee doesn't do it. Yes, Kareem, or then Lou Alcindor, grabs the bag and he says, Linda, which is his, you know, his wife, come here, kick the bag. And she knocks Kareem on his butt. So not only was he explaining things, he could somewhat pass on what he had. And she understood the theory of hitting, 
then she couldn't have knocked Kareem on his butt. I understand the theory of a blend. Good. Don't stop there. Okay. Right. So you know it, it's it's a move we're doing right now, but the real work is clearing out the clutter about how I interfere with that move. And so I'm looking for it. I mean, you know, there's a collective archetype. We go, where do I want to suddenly when Bruce Lee hit, we're not hitting. We're blending. But some of that you want. Because I can get too mental this way. Oh, well, I'm getting too mental. She just punches me in the face with the other hand. I go, that's not Aikido. All right. She comes to do that. The blend takes care of a lot of the other factors. But the right person, one that doesn't interfere with A, B, C, D, is what we're working on. We're also going to work on A, B, C, D. But if you don't get the right person there, you don't necessarily get much. You get some knowledge. But again, Linda kicked the bag. And Kareem is seven foot two. And it's still knocked him on his back. And he became Bruce Lee's student. Bruce Lee didn't have to do it. You see, so if he could teach her to do that. Maybe I should study with him. Okay, good. Um, another, I'm going to try to bring her down. Don't keep turning the hip and see what happens. Now I fall asleep down, she grabs the leg, or she stands up and gets in my face. Right. So right at this particular point, if she makes a movement towards you, there's a counter rotation of the hip. It sets up the entering mark. But we're lengthening it out. Okay? We're not doing eight different techniques today. We're just saying, okay, every single move in Aikido, you can take and examine this way. Now, what am I doing right here? Just rotating my hip and rotating my hip. And now she's going to be quiet. I'm going to take it away. And I don't want to fall asleep for her to grab my leg or stand up and get in my face. Because if she tries that, I'm going to counter rotate the hips and step in. So I have to say a little. Yeah, we're, we're, we're doing a script. This is very scripted. <laughs> and the, the, the funny thing about it, did Bruce Lee say much? No. Hardly spoke. But his presence and his movement spoke volumes. Right? You don't have to yell a lot. And sometimes, you know, we don't want to be the Green Hornet thinking too much. We want to be efficient, focused. And as you get this, then you get the confidence. But that will take you in other areas because you're developing what you would call your key. Right? You're developing your key. So you can stay calm in situations if necessary. I, I mean, what was funny is uh, Cato was a uh, bodyguard, but he was really the whole modus course of our operation. Right? He had the, he had the power, he had the intelligence. He was a star in a very secondary role. Okay, so I kind of like that. Don't don't be too don't show off. He didn't show off when he hit in that show. He hit. Was he showing off? We go. What was that? Okay. So anyway, let's let's see if we can add. I went right here. I'm going to try to take her down. No, I'm going to keep turning the hip. I'm not about here. Oh. And then I'm going to stay alert right here. She turns into me. I'm going to be ready. Okay. Okay. Let's let's keep the same partner for one more turn. Okay. And let's, let's add a little bit of that down. Okay.
Yeah, okay. Now, one other thing right there, okay? Well, this one here, I'm gonna try to take you down. No, I'm just gonna keep rotating my hip. I'm gonna keep rotating my hip. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, huh? Right? So that's, a, a, you, you know, most people kind of, but it's cool. Good grip. Good, good, good grip. Good grip. Good grip. Oh yeah, good grip, good grip. Now, I'm gonna slide here. I'm gonna try to take you down, no. I'm going to keep turning my hip. I'm going to turn my hip. I'm going to turn my hip. Turn my hip. There. Turn, 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 turn. I don't want you to bump my leg. Okay. Well, at some point, I'm going to pull this out so they're creating space for you. You know, so, you know, an extreme case, you take somebody down that way and their, their face goes right into your knee. End of whatever it is, right? Very good stuff. The other thing right there, for example, right about here, for combat, boom. But then we get, you know, I mean, you know, you see this class, everybody comes in and punches everybody in the face trying to be Bruce Lee. But then they get really pissed at me. Okay. But, you know, it's still a martial art. On the other hand, what we're exploring is permanent. And we're exploring some sort of a, a personal growth, right? All you're doing is teaching technique. Yeah, but without that, that's how we measure, right? You're going to, Make something a, a recipe. You have to have a measuring cup. I, I got to kind of estimate. You know? a measuring cup. Okay, that's what the technique is. So right here. Okay, I go back. Components one, two, three, four. Without you interfering. Oh, okay, good. Now slide behind. Now right there. Don't try to bring me down. Keep your feet where they are. No, 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 no don't. Okay. If the shoulder wants to get away, don't. Okay. Turn, turn, just keep turning, turn, turn. You know, right about there, I go like that. Now, you don't want me to land. I keep pull that leg back. Mm, okay. But you stay behind me. Okay. And then if I try to stand up on you, you rotate your hip and you enter. Okay? And one of the things, you know, how does this happen? He's coming this way and I go this way. We're going to collide. Okay? So what if I go this way? Oh, oh. This way. Boom. Right? You know, then he grabs my wrist or then go this way, then we go this way. We have an ETO. But I get over, you know, okay. I'm going to go, oh, I'm going to change of direction. And right about here, take a song, just a boom, we'll go that way, boom. Easy. You didn't see Bruce Lee sweat too much. His movements were so efficient. You know, I mean, some of those, the fight scenes in his movies, yeah. Right. But in the green hornet, what? Yeah, okay. You know, you don't want to dialogue with me. You know, you know we, need, we need to get on the same page here. And I, since I have the podium right now, I'm going to give you the podium later, but you know, you turn in this direction and I'm going to point out the fact you've been listening too much fake news. <laughs> Right, and that's about it. I mean, you know, it's uh, my school. I mean, the Green Horn is not popular culture anymore, because, yeah. but it's it's part of popular culture from the 60s, and it was before then a radio show. I used to listen to it, believe it or not. Couldn't, there was the Tato wasn't anything other than the driver, you know. And then, yeah. Um, He's turning on the connection. Oh, going to happen in a split. After all, you know, you, you, you connect the dots quicker as you get a little bit clearer. That's what they're misunderstanding. They're teaching techniques. Now, the technique is a measuring cup. Now the question is, if you're gonna put flour in, that's good, but if you put milk in instead of flour, you, you might, well, yeah, the cup is empty, right? That's what we, we said. Measuring cups to measuring cups. Don't, don't, don't do that too much or you, you, you kind of miss it. It's fascinating if you look at it that way. Because it's a, it's a great, you know, sort of tool for personal growth. 
and you you learn some stuff. You know, if we're going to collide here, he's going to push things, going to pull out of them. Just a little. Hey. Mm -hmm. yep. Come on in. In fact, we've got a little motion there. Huh? You come charging at me, then it's oh. easier. I'll let him do the work. <laughs> okay? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Now, what we're going to do, uh, see, we're, we're, he's gonna, now he's coming in here. We're, we're, we're going we're gonna to work some motion. Okay? You don't want to go through life feeling like things are tying you up. After a while, you see something come. I'm going to step back. Okay? Now I'm going to step in here. And then we're going to go back. Okay. Now, new person. Okay. Or newer person. You can sit. All right. The problem is if you put this on somebody who, let's say, uh, if they, for, for, you don't know you're supposed to fall. <laughs> I'm not going to do anything crazy. Yeah. But when this comes fast, it's wrist now. Your wrist breaks in about three places. Okay, so you didn't come to class. You walk out of here and you have to have your wrist in a cast. But what we can do, get the forward roll. That's fine. Develop a, a variety of different things. Okay, I fall down, I can take a sit fall. But I trip over a skateboard and I'm going head over heels and I can't turn around and sit on my butt. So I'm gonna to have to roll safely going forward. So what you can do right here, boom. Come on in, okay. Boom. Right. Okay, now we sat, now what I like him to do. <laughs> okay, we're writing a, a script. Take right. a forward roll. Take right. a forward roll. Step into it, take a forward roll. That step is important. Most of the time in life you lose your balance, you take a step and recover it. But we're practicing for I take a step and I can't. I'm gonna go face forward anyways, and I need to take a hit. Falling when you forward. I'm just really that black ball. This is wrong. This increases your speed. Okay. Back. Do any. Now come on. There are other ways to do it. Now, to go here. 
I'm going to turn my Yeah. 
their country. And as a patient, you know, you you know, and it's not a case, it was something like Kevin, but it's still impossible to get smarter. Just smarter. Right. Simple to put. Step here. I don't big classic. Take a little bit more. More and more. It's easier to take is to go. And I was going to to do that move. Well, move that one. Busy, right? Okay. Step back. Step back. Reflect. Go to play. Not good. How? And he's flowing. Pick up moves. Metric. Good. All right. Okay. All right there. You're the new stuff. Go this way. Good. This way. All right. Turn. Step back. Step back. And turn. People right here. Do the left. Turn the hip. Stop that. And stop that. Three. Oh, it's good. Stop. Stop. Okay, I'm fine. Just hold. Keep the foot on. Make sure your wrist cut. What do you do? All right. So, for the move.
Thank you. 